Hello everybody, this is Tropical Vibes 305 back here to show you another video. So this is a video of a ROM hack called the Missing Link. I have been trying to find it myself and I have noticed that it's a bit outdated. It's pretty late for me, I guess you could say, to be playing it, but if you're like me and wanted to try it out and not just watch a gameplay, this is the video for you. So Looking through all these videos and seeing that it's two years old and, well, you can't really download it, I have found places to download it for you guys. So, if you want to go on ahead and check out this game, as you can see right here, it absolutely works. And I'm going to be going step by step on how to get it. Because let's face it, on the videos that we have, of the links that we have clicked on, oh wow, pun there, um, we notice that we can't have access to it. We can't go into the Mega, we can't do, do none of that. So, what's the next best thing? How are we going to get to it? Well, like I said, this is the video. So, let's begin. Oh, and before we enter my little domain, um, the links will be on the description. Okay, welcome to my little domain. So, in this video, we're going to go to Vim's Lair. This is the first step for getting the, the ROM hack. What you want to do is make sure you get version 1.0, which is 24.98 megabytes, how it should be, you know. Complete difference, 25, 24, not really much of a difference, but whatever. You are going to click on download. And once you do, you're going to wait for it to pop up. If it decides to. There you go. There it is, right here. This is the first step. Now for the second step. <clears throat> what we want to do for the second step. Oh, wow. It's a little bit on the lag side. So what we want to do for the second step, we're going to go to Google, and we're going to go on to the missing link of ROM hack download. We're going to go to the very first link, okay, pun, and you're going to see all of this stuff. It's going to look different if you're using Google Chrome or an Explorer, but I like to use Oprah. And so from here, we're going to click on download. So you can see it is already automatically downloading how it awesomely should be. And so the second, no, the third step. Wow, I'm already lost. On the third step, what we're going to go for is ROM Patcher JS. gonna go ahead and click on it there and so it's gonna take you to this website now what does this website do this website basically patches any problems that you may have for a game so if you were to create a patch and you want to put it into the game itself you gotta make sure that they are completely synchronized so here is what we're gonna be going for Let's bring this baby out real quick boom we're gonna minimize this exit out here we don't need this right now we are going to move this over here and we're gonna take this so what we're gonna do we're gonna highlight these two drag it out here exit out highlight these three take it out here exit out this is little eden and this is big eden so basically these two patches right here are to as you can see in the readme are to basically help patches when it comes to z64 or just n64 the n64 is for the little eden the z64 is for the big eden you can read more into details once you get the note and as for Vin's Lair, it just gives you basically information about the game. So, 
you are going to get the game, drag it over here to ROM file. Now you're going to see CRC32 and the rest of the hieroglyphic numbers. <laughs> now you see little Eden, right? If you drag it over there, it's going to say there's a checksum mismatch. And it's going to give you red. If you apply the patch, a thousand percent chance that it will not work. That's why it's red. But if you attach the big Eden and read the README instruction manual, not only do you get a check mark, but it'll go green. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna apply the patch. The patch will download. And all you gotta do is go into your downloads. Where is it? Ah, download, download, download. There you are. Little download section right here. We're gonna minimize this, and we're gonna go over to your Emu Center, as I like to call it, N64. I already have the game, but I can just remove it for the sake of the video. This is the patch version right here. We're gonna delete. As you can see as proof, you see, and I have 30 seconds, great. We're going to go to the patch right here, slap it on here, exit out, exit out. Oh crap, it's here. I got to wait 15 seconds, god damn it. Kind of have to like remove this in the video. Keep on waiting, keep on waiting, keep on waiting, keep on waiting. Two, one, perfect. Alright, so here we are. I'm gonna double click. And here we are, Nintendo 64. You see this? It works, it's good. And quite honestly, this fan-made game is pretty freaking dope. So, yeah. I hope you guys liked the video. And if you guys want more videos like this of how to basically well, work things out and play the games, just hit the comment section below. Give me some likes or dislikes. And share this video around to your buddies. I really want to get this game. I will be posting many different tutorials depending on well what tutorials you guys are in need of. And I'll see if I can get it out there. This is Tropical Vibes and I'm gonna go chill.